Keenan Chan Holtz here, West Virginia Land and Home Realty on lot number 68 in High Mountain Orchards, Romney, West Virginia. This property is five and a quarter acres, and you got these tremendous 180 degree mountain views. Just check that out. You're looking south that way, that big, that big maple tree or hickory trees on this lot, uh, and east this way. So you're pretty much facing due east, and uh, back in the 50s, 60s, and 70s, there's an orchard on top of this mountain, and they developed it in the 80s. And uh, you can see there's a couple big old apple trees still left on this lot. Um, some people try to save them, you know, and some people have done a good job at doing that up here. But basically, you know, you just clear out the brush, clear out your spot, and, and you got a ready-made spot for a home or a cabin. And the, the thing about up here is you can't drill a well, so you have to have a cistern. And what a cistern is, it's basically just a, a big plastic tank you bury in the ground and fill it up with water. Uh, they range in sizes from 500 gallons up to 2,000 gallons. And uh, there's a multitude of ways to fill a cistern. You can do rainwater collection. You can have a guy haul you like 1,300 gallons of city water for like 120 bucks, or you can haul it yourself. And there's people that have cabins up here. There's people that live up here full time. And uh, you know, you get used to it. Once you figure the whole cistern thing out, um, it's pretty easy. Um, regular septic systems up here no issues with that the electrics right behind me so it's pretty pretty easy to to you know build on these lots uh and the cisterns you know cheaper than a well uh in the short term anyways but um so here's the deal with this lot this one's priced at twenty five thousand dollars and you might think ah, why is that so cheap well the guy who owns this lot got it from a guy who bought it at a tax sale and the man that he purchased it from got it at a tax sale in april of 21 i believe so when you get a tax lien deed you get the property it's deeded in your name but you can't get title insurance on it or borrow money on it or against it for three years so whoever buys this lot's going to have to pay cash for it and i think in april of 24 you can get, um, you know, title insurance on it, sell it where somebody can get a loan on it, borrow money against it, whatever. So you're taking a very, very small roll of the dice here, uh, but you're getting a $15,000 discount on the lot to do so. So uh, that's probably the best way I can explain it. My attorney can explain it. We've sold a lot of properties like this. I understand how it works. But uh, if you're willing to take a little risk here, you're gonna get a big reward. I mean, just check this thing out. This is real, it's not made up. It really looks like this.